There I am. No, not the little child. The dirty looking child was in the background. I bet you're wondering why I'm running around like crazy people. bad idea. people is a fish tapeworm. This is a frequent human intestinal parasite in many areas where freshwater fish is consumed. Human infection with the fish tapeworm is referred to as diphleobothriasis. Feces from infected hosts or raw sewage contaminants, a freshwater source. Tapeworm larvae are initially ingested by freshwater crustaceans and then are eaten by fish. Human infection occurs when a person consumes raw fish contaminated with tapeworm larva. Adult tapeworms then develop in the human intestinal tract, where your tummy is. Not good. Most infections with the fish tapeworm are not associated with symptoms. The tapeworm causes little damage in the lining of the intestine. Infected individuals may report diarrhea, fatigue, weakness, or a sensation of hunger more commonly than uninfected individuals. One person unique to this tapeworm is that it may compete with the host for absorption of vitamin B12 from the small intestine, causing the person to become deficient in this vitamin and leading to a condition called pernocious arnia. T A P E E. No, tape. Tape. Worms. Hmm, tape. Pineapples? Have I been eating the wrong remedy? <laughs> I'm the evil tapeworm. I'm going to eat everything inside of you, your food. <laughs> Chica, es lo que 
tapeworms.org. One treatment that has been in use since the early 1960s is nicolocide. This drug is poorly absorbed into the intestinal tract, and but rapidly kills the tapeworm. Rapidly. Charlie, I'm really tired, and my tummy feels like it's filled with worms. Hey, that's my friend. That's nicolocide. What is that? It helps your tummy feel better. Worms. Oh. <laughs> yes! Is this child safety? Didn't I tell you not to give me child safety? I'm tired of this crap! Shut up! I'll take it home! How many? How many? Five.